Hello guys and welcome to this new Tableau tutorial. In this video, I will show you how to create a funnel chart in Tableau. Funnel charts are generally used to display a given quantity through different stages or categories, from the highest to the lowest stage or value. As you can see here in our example, we are going to use a table that I have created for the different hiring steps. And as you can see here, we have six different lines. The first one is how many people applied for the job. The second one is the resumes selected. Then we have the HR first contact. We have test, interview, and finally we have the total people hired. So we have mainly three different techniques to create funnel chart in Tableau. So the first one, we click on sheet one. We can create it using the following steps. So we drag and drop step into the rows, total into columns. We select the entire view. We sort our data. We press Ctrl key and we duplicate sum of total. We double click on the axis and we select reversed. So like that, we get a final chart. We can also format that. For example, we can click on format workbook. For the grid lines, we select off. Zero lines, same thing, we select off. And also for the axis rulers, we select off. We right click format and for the column divider we select none and like that to get our final chart we can also hide the headers right and in the first one we can press ctrl key we add this step into the label for the second one we press ctrl key and we add the sum of total into the label we click on label for the alignment we select left and same thing for the first one we select left okay if you want to use colors you can same thing press ctrl key and drag and drop the step into color and for example if you want to use the color where the highest value for example represents the darker color we can press ctrl key and we drag and drop some of total into the detail and select color so like that we have completed the different steps for the first technique to create a funnel chart in Tableau. For the second technique, so click on your worksheet. Same thing, we drag and drop step into the rows, total into the columns. We sort and we select the entire view. Same thing, we duplicate our value, double click, reversed, and instead of automatic, we select the area chart. Okay. So like that, we get also the second type of the final chart. Same thing, we can format that. So hide the header, hide the header. We can also hide the title. We can format that for the row divider, we select none. And same thing for the column divider, we select none. We can click on color and the opacity to 100%. And also we can add the labels. So we add the step in here. And also we add the total. We can same thing, select for example, this alignment. And like that we get our funnel chart. For the third step, we are going to create six different calculated fields. So you click on new worksheet. Down icon in here, create calculated field. And the first one, we call it step number one. So we say if we use the ATR function and we say step equals to applied or we're going to use the lookup function to select the previous value. Same thing ATR function and we select the step and as we have said we select the previous so we select minus one equals to applied same thing then give me the sum of total and okay so I'm going to duplicate this one five times to create for each step calculated field we write apply okay duplicate second time Third time, fourth, and fifth. So the second one, edit 
we select step number two and we have resume selected right same thing in here apply okay next we have step number three which is HR first contact right same thing in here we have HR first contact apply okay step number four we have the test apply okay next we have the interview so step number five we have the interview same thing in here we have interview apply okay and the last one is hired so edit step number six we have hired apply okay Java can draw major names into filters and we select the six steps apply okay we drag and drop step into the rows and measure values into the columns we sort and we select the entire view press ctrl key and we duplicate our value double click and we select reversed we click on all instead of automatic we select the area same thing we press ctrl key and we drag and drop measure names into the color we click on analysis stack marks and we select off and for each calculated field we are going to select compute using step same thing for the second one third one step step and same thing in here compute using the step so like that we get our final chart with different colors for each step now we are going to format our worksheet so we hide the header same thing in here we hide the header right click hide indicator hide title format and we remove the row divider and the column divider for the color we select the opacity to 100% and we can add our labels so we click on the first one we press ctrl key we add step into the label and same thing we add the total to the label so you click on label for the alignment we select down okay and we select the left we can also put it bold black and 11 okay we can hide the legend and like that we get our final chart using the third technique in tableau so that's it for the different steps to create final chart in tableau i hope that you have learned new things thanks for watching and see you in next tutorial